Now, Darren's admitted that he that he took steroids over the years. Mike always will claim that he never has. Do you believe that? No. <laughs> no, I don't. I think everybody has experimented with them uh, over the years. Uh, I did. I didn't get to be on the, the steroid train because I ended up boxing. And so um, I think I took... I think I took a cycle when I first made the show. It's like, hey, you're a gladiator. Here's some juice, you know. So I did like a cycle when I made the gladiators, and I got really big, really fast. Um, but I was starting to do martial arts. That did not work for me when I was sparring and stuff. So um, I didn't do any more after that because I became a professional boxer. And we had a urine test at, at the time. We had, you know, urine tests like crazy. And, uh, you know, for my boxing license, we were always drug tested. So I didn't really – do that much and that's why I wasn't as big or as lean uh, on all that stuff so I just had to work you know it was my great personality that got me through the show so I wasn't shredded like my like my besties and, and all that but um, you know thank God you know none of us have been really hurt you know from doing steroids and you know God's been with us you know we lost Lee Rearman that was Hawk uh, that was from um, I think he had a hip surgery, a, like a, a hip joint replaced and just something freakish happened after that. But everybody's been in great health, um, you know, so I don't think anybody's done any to the extent of, you know, having a heart attack. Um, I know we lost Thunder as well, but I don't think that was his situation either. But yes, I think everybody's experimented with him. Contenders, no, but gladiators, yes. Maybe experimented and uh, um, some say that some track steroids or, or like clenbuterol and Winstrol aren't real steroids, but anything I think that alters you that's unnatural is steroids. So that's just the business we were in, you know, like if you're an NFL football player, you know, you're going to try it. And if it's for you, good. And if it's not, you know, you'll go the other way. Were the contestants tested? Um, no, I don't think so. Um, I was never tested as a gladiator. So during the gladiators, I mean, I don't think there would be any gladiators <laughs> if they were tested, I mean, on a regular basis. So um, I was never tested. Um, I don't think that during that time, uh, you know, for boxing, yeah, you know, boxing had been around a lot longer. But for the gladiators, I don't think it was really thought of as a bad thing. You know, people wouldn't be experimenting with them and, you know, worried about their health as much as they would nowadays. But um, no, t I don't, I don't know if anyone was really tested. If they were tested, maybe it was in private, maybe it was a personal deal, but there wasn't like, Hey, here's, you know, everybody's random steroid test. So not that I remember that. So yeah, I don't think it was that bad back in the day. Yeah. And you were more of a TV show than an Olympic sport. So well, we thought, <laughs> we thought we were the only sport on the planet, but our job depended upon the way that we looked and you being lean and muscular like that. So I think, our situation and our pressure to look like that, you know, is more worthy of making someone do steroids than an Olympic sport. You know, I, I think because it was all about they wanted the bodybuilder look. That's why they didn't test all these people, because they wanted the combination of this larger than life athlete, you know, with uh, someone that was actually athletic 